And what I'm saying is, I've tried to record over 600 songs within two years just to fish out which, which, what I want to do with my album. You will you believe? Shatawale finally reveals why his GOG album is still not released. I mean, he spoke a lot of things on Andy Dusty show this morning, Hit FM, and he's given a couple of reasons why the GOG album is still pending. And yeah, it makes sense because, I mean, dropping an album, sometimes you need a lot of work. Um, I, if I can remember, I need to ask him about what is the difference between GOG album and the Rain album. And he said, yeah. well, the Rain album, he didn't do it for the world. The GOG album, he wants it to be like a global thing. Yeah. Therefore, he needs to put some structures or some, I mean, put certain things down before it actually drops. So, um, before we will play a video of what Shatawala actually said, but I mean, let's let's go through it and then see for our own selves what he said. First of all, he said he gave some reasons why, um, when I listened to him very well, he said, first one, he said he's recorded over 600 songs in the last two years. Mm -hmm. Now, album, no, are we looking at like 10 songs or 20 songs <laughs> or 600 songs? <laughs> so, first of all, he said, first headache is he can't even choose. Mm -hmm. He's finding it difficult to choose mm -hmm. out of 600 songs. And here is your That's a mark of a serious artist. Charlie. Mm. He records every day. And then, the second one, he said, um, distribution deals. He's still searching for a distribution deal because because he wants it to be a global thing. Yeah. He wants to be able to sign, I mean, with a distribution deal so that when the album drops, mm -hmm. they can distribute it worldwide. Um, worldwide. Yeah. So it's also another problem he's facing because mm -hmm. he doesn't just want to do it now for the year, but to Ghana how with audio mark and boom play pet near the you stream it. Yeah. Or per se a worldwide movement thing. And then you know third reason. He said, um, the promotion wise, it's Kasem. He wants to really put a lot of money, invest in it before, I mean, the whole thing come out. And also the marketing aspect is looking at that side. And also, or per se, adding videos, we should be any day, any classic. He's not just going to shoot any videos. So he's looking at promotion, marketing, and the videos he's going to shoot. So he's considering all, I mean, all these, these mm -hmm. reasons why the album is still pending so we have um 600 songs to choose from we yeah. have distribution deals still Deal. searching and then we have promotion marketing and videos that he wants to work on what is your comment on this um i think it's it's a very intelligent move from yeah Katawali. yeah this very very you know, very serious because he's been doing albums and at this you know time in his career mm. he's thinking global you mm. know and ghana move like most of the time, when we talk about global stuff, global na let's say Ghana and Yumbe hit you in Nigeria. So these days, global na asasa, and I'm happy about it, you know, because because no more global no more na kid there then they are called India, they are called platinum, platinum which is so I think yeah that that's the global thing we are talking about. So now global has gone beyond just Nigeria or Africa or something. Nigeria and you winning an award at a Nigerian event, global for Ghanaian artists has gone beyond that, mm. which is which is good news for okay. everyone, including emerging artists mm. like myself. Mm. So, um, number one, he has a variety of songs he wants to choose from, mm. and 600 songs in two years. Mm. That's a mark of a serious artist. I mean, he's recording every day. My only issue is, with the production, mm -hmm. he should, you know, bring on board different producers. Okay. Right. It shouldn't be just one local, way. international. In the mean, maybe it's but sometimes, I mean, you yes, know, the album is a, 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 like different flavors for yeah. it. Flavors, so, and yes. Different cultures. Yes. You know, because. Produce a Biani do it then. Different fingers. It if it is from Shatawali, it might not be the same, but mm -hmm. they will have some print in it that you know that yeah. this bit kind of has something to do with it. Because and you are tagging it global. Yes. So people should at least widen outside, it up. Know. Now, oh, oh, I mean, Me. talking of uh, collaboration with some um, alleged collaborations we had, like mm -hmm. with Beyonce, with McMill, with Rihanna, mm -hmm. with Vibes Cartel, Vibes, yeah. a whole lot. And with Naira all Mali. these artists, so now what them not producer? I don't think so. Sometimes open it up. Yeah. Maybe I, Vibes Cartel. 
Alberto Kojimi Kakope, one of the baddest makers from Nepal. And now, while you're a big boy, you can walk into any Jamaican studio and exactly. So I think, say, I don't know, a nice point. He shouldn't let the beat come from himself or one one producer only. It should be like I mean, multiples this thing. Right. Yeah. You know, emo you know me idea. This bit more. How can I do? I can do me nonsense more. Oxygen more, but make sure I'm fine. I mean, and these young guys, they are good. You know. Well. And then to the part of the distribution, I think that's also, also, also like another fantastic point. Okay. Because it's through some of these deals that people easily get Grammy nominations and stuff. Because yes. Once it, yes. You know, you, you're being distributed worldwide. Worldwide. You're, you're on charts. Mm. You know, your head all over. And so I think that's another fantastic move. So okay. it won't be an album that he himself said will last for two months, three months, and it will be gone. An album that will make impact. Exactly. So with these things that Wally is saying, if it happens, I'm expecting something very huge. And congrats to him. I mean, he has, he has, he has evolved. But uh, everything he said, are we looking at Gog album this year for now? Well, well, he said everything depends on the deals and everything he's working on. But yeah, I mean, for our own sake, are we expecting with the conversation he's having? Yes, I think there's a little more work to mm. be added to what he has already done. So mm. let's let's be patient. Actually, I'm I'm really anticipating, you know, because the the Nkomana album there, the part, yeah, um, certain a GOG album, which should be very impactful. Mm. Anyway, so that is what Shatwali has to say about the Gog album, and yeah. then we are patiently waiting for. We're it. praying I mean, for him. We're wishing him well. well they all can. I mean, let's he should take his him. time, yeah, get the deals, everything now, so that at least. Uh, but it should be a global thing because yeah. at the end it's a Ghana win. It, it, it's, it's a win for Ghana. Pa, 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 pa. Why didn't you why didn't you continue? Were you just teasing the fans or you disrespected us? So I have a strategy, you know, and until that is done, people will understand why I did all those things. So one the problem one of the problems I've given you is the distribution of the album. I don't want it to be distributed in Ghana alone, in Ghana, Ghana, Nigeria. It's something I'm doing for the world. Okay. You understand me? So it's it's, it's not and you be big to an You know, and it needs a great budget. What am I saying? And I'm just trying so hard to get it well. Does that mean that if you don't get a good budget, you won't release it? No, I'll release it, but that's what I'm saying. I'm working on things myself. Me and Gaza me work by Mexicano. Because hey, I mean I know how to save and manage myself already. So I'm just seeing but the kind of videos i want to put out there the 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 the, 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 the type of promotions i want to do like you know the marketing around the gog album is is and me spending time every day in the studio sometimes like sometimes i even wonder why i even have so much time for the album like that and i, I tell myself no this is something that is going to do something so this album naramali mm. so far we know only naramali mm. then you gave us some teasers that you were you were featuring Vibes Cartel. Yeah. The guy is is locked up in jail. Mm. I know. So are you lying? No, oh, I'm gonna lie. Vibes Cartel is in jail while he's stopping charts in Jamaica. You know? And you know, thanks to the Jamaican government, I think maybe they've given him some privileges to record and you know, because his songs are out there like up to now. You go to Jamaica right now, like one to five, he's stopping charts, you know. And you know, that's a blessed man, you know. Vibes, I see Vibes Cartel like dance all you know jesus christ in the world okay so yeah. vibes cartel mm. naramali yeah who else and you don't see <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't have mentioned you shouldn't have mentioned that you shouldn't have mentioned that uh, okay yeah who else okay <laughs> my brother you know you say we'll be on the album one hey you're quite international uh, 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 sma sma <laughs> sma <laughs> Stingy man <laughs> <laughs> association. I don't go uh, mention. Okay, so, so you mentioned two artists. Okay, so three artists. Uh, Who else? Yeah, three artists. So uh, the rest, let's keep it for the next interview. In, any international act? Yeah, I have a couple of things you know on there. You know, I don't just I just don't want to disclose it now. So yeah, there's, there were rumors yeah. of you recording with Rihanna and then what Beyonce? Who else? Ah, uh, uh, hey, let me tease them a little bit. Hey, I beg you. I beg you. No, 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 Charlie. Yo, <laughs> listeners, check. Now, li listen, listen to this, folks.